that's a brilliant way to start you this video. Would. Shut up. Uh, you anyway, said it. you said it, bro. I am back. Oh and God. This is episode three. This is episode tres of Ranting with Rodimus. Your truly. With MJ behind the camera. Yo. Pocket sitting back there chilling. Mainstream oh. drinking his drink like he's drinking alcohol. That bottle had family. That drink, though. Anyway, no <laughs> about him. Like I said, this is episode three. In today's episode, I want to talk about all you damn restaurants again. Oh, People who God. can't comprehend. <laughs> fucking restaurant employees. You can't fucking comprehend. What was it, two weeks ago? We went yep. to Burger King. That's two weeks ago. Yep. Yeah, two weeks ago. I ordered an A1 double cheeseburger. I said, no onions. Now, the cashier, she was nice, you know. She got my order. I saw it on the screen and said, no onions. So it's not her fault. All you cashiers who do your job like you're supposed to, it's not your fault. But you damn cooks in that damn kitchen. You can't comprehend. When you see that screen on that above whatever it is, and you see no onions, or somebody says no tomatoes, like for example, me and my sister were talking the other day. She don't like tomatoes. She likes pickles. She eats them separately. But she don't like tomatoes. If she says no tomatoes on her sandwich, what does that tell you? No tomatoes on the sandwich. Don't put tomatoes on the sandwich. I said no onions on my burger. What did they do? They put onions on my burger. Hell yeah. And of course I check my food before we leave. <laughs> I come back here. I open it up. Use what like is it on my sandwich? Onions. Onions. Use now like onions, <laughs> I can't stand it. I hate them. Onion rings, I love them. I'll eat them all day if I wanted to. You hypocritical motherfucker. So, <laughs> it's so true. Onion rings are better than onions. Well, hypocrite. So what? Gotta go with a little Chris Jericho on it. Hypocrite. Anyway, all you damn cooks in that damn kitchen, when you read that damn screen, it tells you what the customer wants on their sandwich and what it, what they don't want on their sandwich. Can you not comprehend that? Sweet pussy. Really? God. Hashtag. Hashtag sweet pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Pockets had to enlighten the mood because I'm just I'm just pissed off with these restaurants right now, bro. I can't mostly, take it. Mostly fast food. Mostly, mostly fast food well, restaurants, bro. I can't deal with no more. If I could point out a little criticism, I mean the way you're just like flipping your shit, you remind me of uh, fucking Lewis Black. Hell yeah. And the other now, thing, you remember, this shit, I, you remember him I from uh, him. Daily Show? Cause yeah. He'll, he'll yeah. have a big ass rant about anything. Even some of his comedy specials. Like back then, he used to flip his lid. Now, the second thing is, you have to remember, you're arguing this stuff about fast food joints. Listen, there are employees in that restaurant that can't comprehend. Now, see, that's the thing. It's a fast food joint. They're going to make the food, and they're going to ship it out there. They're not going to care what's on it, as long as it's, you know, fast food. Well, well, evidently, they went to school, and they didn't read. Because on the screen, it says, no onions. And plus they beat Somebody out. says, no lettuce. It says, no lettuce. Don't put the lettuce on the sandwich. If I don't want no lettuce, don't put it on the sandwich. <laughs> but see, if you want to voice your complaints about that, go to a dine-in restaurant, not a fucking fast food joint. Food is food, damn it. It's <laughs> not what you said about onions. Because I don't like onions. Fucking hypocrite. Just because I like onion rings doesn't make me a hypocrite. So onion rings are better. It does. It makes you a big ass hypocrite. Oh, fuck. Anyway, <laughs> enough of my rant about people who can't comprehend. This is episode three of Ranting with Rodimus. Next month, we will be doing episode four. And trust me, for all you men and all you ladies out there, you're going to listen to what I got to say. The question for episode four is why. Do you eat the booty? <laughs> <laughs> You know what? They got in light in the mood, because, I mean, I had to go on this tirade, so, Malcolm, thank you for that. If you will. And Pockets, too. But anyway. I didn't do anything. <laughs> anyway. Episode 4. I was just trying to be an ass. You succeeded. You succeeded. I think it's working. You got it from our cameraman. Well, yeah. I wouldn't say that. 
I'm not directly to blame for that. But anyway, episode four is going to talk about why do good people want dick nuts on the chin. Chill <laughs> out, <Hello>, man. <laughs> <laughs> Evidently, you know about that. Oh. Black kettle black. I mean. Racist? <laughs> That's not racism. It's a phrase. Anywho. Anyway. In all seriousness. Episode 4 is going to talk about why do good people get passed over for trash. That's true. I mean, mm-hmm. I mean, I it's a good question my uncle raised the other day when we were having a conversation. I'm like, like women. It's no, women and men in general. Well, yeah, both, both sides. But mostly men. Yeah, mostly but men. But you all are going to want to hear what I got to say next month. Are okay. you sure about that? Trust me. Gonna... You nearly exploded with this video, so. I had to. Because I can't stand onions on my, on my shit. <laughs> anyway, I gotta go. These guys are really just killing me. <laughs> that last one, you brought it on yourself. Oh. <sighs> Most people say that, right? No. <clears throat> yes. Anyway, this is episode three. I'm Rodimus. I gotta go because these guys are killing me. I gotta go. Good day, you, sir. Shut up.